disturbing discovery. Good evening, I'm Tanner Hesterberg. Tonight, police in Pike County say they're trying to figure out why a woman allegedly assaulted an elderly man. They say Angela Polly assaulted a family member earlier this month at the Housing Authority in Pike County. WYMT's Corey McCauley spoke to police about the case. Strangling, punching, and visible wounds. Pikeville police say evidence of these things were discovered after an assault on an elderly man. He obviously had visible injuries around his neck uh, that appeared to be scratches on both sides of his neck and the front, which is uh, indicative of strangling. The Pikeville Police Department arrested Angela Polly Wednesday after they received a complaint she assaulted 85-year-old John Carter. Carter is Polly's step-grandfather. The arrest warrant details that witnesses saw Polly assault the man. Police tell me John Carter is legally blind and has dementia. Police say the entire encounter was caught on video. We could see a female subject who um, was going, came out of one of the residence room, uh, and then she took, in a hurry, she throwed her purse down and stormed back toward the room that she came out. Officials say it happened August 8th at Myers Towers in Pikeville. The arrest warrant says Polly grabbed the man around the neck and began striking him with her fists. Uh, you can see her grabbing the male subject. Uh, she also punched him several times in the face. Police were unable to show the video since the case is still open. They say if you suspect someone is abusing an elderly person, to call local law enforcement officers. In Pike County, Corey McCauley, WYMT Mountain News. Pikeville police say they're working with adult services to investigate that case.